Welcome to our new segment. This is where you, our viewers and readers, get to write in on social media and ask me a question about food or lifestyle. And our first question comes from Carly in Maryland. And Carly said, I haven't exercised in a long time, but I want to get into exercise and fitness again, but I feel a little intimidated. Do you have any tips or ideas, especially for someone who doesn't have a lot of money? I absolutely love this question because I hear you, and this was me a few years ago. Uh, I really wanted to get into fitness, especially being part of the vegan community. I feel like health and fitness is constantly talked about, but I felt really intimidated because I hadn't done anything in a while. So the first thing I did was think about what I could do that would be easily accessible and also budget friendly, and that was walking and eventually running. Uh, if you want to get into walking and running, you pretty much just need a really good pair of sneakers. You can find a running store near you, and that would be the one thing to invest in. Another advantage of walking and running is that you can listen to podcasts. That's one of my favorite things to do. Make really fun playlists, get an audiobook. There's lots of great audiobook services now online, so you can actually learn a little bit and get some reading done <laughs> or get some listening done if you'd like while you're getting in shape. There are a lot of really awesome free apps that you can use as well and if you have a smartphone you can download an app like RunKeeper or the Nike Plus app and that actually uses a GPS system to track where you're going and how fast you're going. A nice thing about something like a RunKeeper app is that if you choose to you can share it with people on your own personal social media accounts. I know for me if I start to do that I feel like I'm in competition with people <laughs> and I don't want running or fitness to be about competition I want it to be about me feeling well so Every time I use them, I keep all that information private, which is also an option. But if you choose to share it, you may find that somebody else that you're friends with is, is working on their fitness too, and you can actually find a really great support system that way. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching Save the Kales, and I hope you will try these dishes that we made and join us next time. Bye-bye.